I want the Reuben bun. Look at that, that's nice. Does it Looks work? Good. Yeah, it does work. Ready to play. Nice, look. What's up guys, Leslie Robbins here. Young Hollywood is center court at the Farmers Classic Finals at UCLA. Sam Query is going for his third win in four years. Please welcome on the Strauss Stadium Court, Sam Query and Ricardo Borica. You are now officially the winner again of the Farmers Classic. The emotions going through your head right now. Uh, I'm just really happy. Uh, I, you know, I missed this tournament last year with elbow surgery, so I'm just happy to be back here and happy to be in the winner's circle again. Can you tell me about the Samurai Club? Uh, it's mainly all my, my group of best friends from high school. All my friends growing up in Thousand Oaks, and so they always come out to this tournament every year, and it's, uh, you know, they're loud, they're fun, they're crazy, and it's, you know, I love listening to what they've got to say. I love when the announcers actually tell them to be quiet because they get a little rowdy sometimes. Yeah, you know, not all, or basically none of them play tennis, so they don't really know the uh, all the rules, and you're supposed to be quiet, and uh, so it feels more like a uh, you know like a basketball atmosphere sometimes when they're out here. You now join the ranks with Agassi and Connors in the open air, a third guy to win three. That is amazing company. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm definitely not at their level uh, overall, but it's definitely nice to be mentioned in the in the same category as those two. I know you've openly talked about this, but at one point you were deciding between playing tennis in college or going pro. I think this win may help ease your mind on that decision a bit. Uh, yeah, I've, my mind was made up, you know, eased, I guess, a long time ago. But uh, yeah, you know, back in the day I was going to go to USC and I had some success right before school started and, and chose to go pro and it's been a, a great decision for me. So you lived in LA at one point and then you moved to Vegas. Obviously you were having lunch with Agassi while you were training once a week, I'm sure. And now you're moving to Dallas. I heard for your girlfriend, talk about the rationale to move to Texas. Uh, I've, I've already moved there. I moved there in, in April. I've only been there for probably two or three weeks just because I moved there and then went to Europe to play and now I'm here. But yeah, my uh, my girlfriend Emily went to school there and she's working there now. So uh, yeah, we, we're living there and it's it's going great so far. So what's uh, home life like outside of tennis? Um, well, like I said, we've probably only been in Dallas for like two or three weeks, but uh, you know, we're still kind of organizing our place, putting pictures up, organizing the TV, the internet, um, cook occasionally. and. You know, it's fun. I just kind of usually just relax on those weeks. Sometimes I'll practice, but it's mainly just kind of getting rejuvenated and ready for the next tournament. All right, you brought up cooking. I have to ask, what are you good at? What are you making? Um, I'm good at going to get in my car and going to pick something up. <laughs> I'm not a great cook. I'll try. You know, I'll try to get on the barbecue and cook some, some steaks and chickens and stuff like that, but uh, I'm not that good. You gotta be good. Give me one main dish that you love to cook. Okay, waffles. I'm pretty good at making waffles. I love waffles. It's like my favorite food. I've got a couple waffle makers at home, so I'll try those. the easy on the eyes Belgian duo Xavier and Ruben going for the doubles win. So gentlemen I have to say when I was hanging out with you guys when you were warming up I knew you were gonna win I felt it in the air. <laughs> uh, I mean it's tough I mean they were a good doubles team but uh, you know, we've been playing well and we've been having fun and uh, enjoying uh, our games we actually enjoyed uh, all four of them so uh, yeah, that's, I think that's the most important thing in doubles and uh, you know we have good uh, chemistry together and uh, it was a lot of fun. Okay, part of your charm, besides being fabulous tennis players, you guys have a look going for you. You guys have perfected the tennis bun. Can you show me how you do that? My hair is sticking out. No, you guys don't have you guys don't have the flyaways. People, you know, put their hair in buns, they have the flyaways. You guys have perfect hair buns. <laughs> yeah, Ruben's gonna show you. He's, he's like a little... Uh, I'm the expert. I'm the expert in the hair. <laughs> wow. Watch out, ladies. <laughs> so first thing, I <laughs> I just pull my hair together, that everything is uh, fine back, that I have every hair on my uh, on my head. Yeah. Then yeah, you probably know it. You have a as a girl, you you gotta know how to pull a, yeah. a bun, how to do a bun. Huh? That's it. So I'm gonna take it like this, put my hair together. Uh, who's that? So, 
twist it a couple of times that I feel that it's nice and tight and then just make it a bun like this put and there you go. I want a bun. I want, want the bun? Yeah. I want the Reuben bun. Look at that. That's nice. Does it Looks work? Good. Yeah, it does work. Ready to play. Nice look. Well, I'm Xavier Melise and I'm Ruben Bimmelmans and you're, and you're watching, watching Young, Young Hollywood. Hollywood.